Hello to all my YouTubers out there. How are we all doing today? You know what? I just got to be honest. I got to be honest with you all. Um, from the last video that I posted, um, yeah, it, it still stuck with me. I'm healing. I've been at my dad's recently. And, uh, you know, we just basically talked a lot and worked a lot and all that stuff. But um, I just got to say that, uh, I, I'm just going to say this, it's, um, it's not easy, okay, with um, relationships or long distance. Uh, I wish it could be easy, but y you know what, I'm just going to say this, this girl that I've mentioned to that made a 14 so much video out of. I don't know if I put this in there or not, but I'm going to say it in this one. If I did, then I'm just doing it as a recap. But what she told me is that she rather has things naturally, come naturally to her. And since her age was, you know, around a close enough number to mine, because I'm 26, she's 29, whatever. Um... She, you know, said, oh, I'm just going to let it come naturally. I'm still keeping her anonymous out of respect and everything like that. But she's so she what she does, because, you know, I don't drive. She, you know, unfortunately doesn't drive. But the thing is, she just for some reason wanted me in the here and now. But with coming naturally, it's just it just didn't hold up its end so even when we were you know a thing and stuff which I thought we were a thing uh her idea of coming naturally is probably somewhere closer even though I'm like two hours or so away or something out of reach it's like I could easily go on a bus to see her but she just couldn't imagine the distance between us two so um don't be fooled when it comes to thinking that oh yeah we're gonna work out we're gonna have just a fun time gaming buddies all this stuff next thing you know it it's just one slip of a girl's thought process that will instantly think you could trust her and everything's great and then all of a sudden, one thing happens or slips up. And then the next thing, you're replaced. And it's just the worst feeling. So if you've been there and you've trusted a girl to, you know, all this stuff. I just don't understand, though, why when she said come naturally. But allow things to go in naturally and all that stuff. Just to be pushed away because of the distance that's not too far away. It's it's crazy to think that you you know. But anyways that I'm I'm trying to move on every day. Every day is a new day to move on, move forward and leave the past behind and everything like that. So I'm staying strong and thank you for all the comments from the last video. Even if there it wasn't that many, I still appreciated it and the likes and all that support and uh feedback and especially on my TikTok and everything. You guys mean so much to me and I I couldn't have been in a better place of my life without all of you so thank you for all the encouragement and kind words and you know as me being a Christian all that all the God words and stuff like that that really touched my heart and stuff so thank you um but yeah it's just I'm just gonna say it like don't be fooled by a girl that says, okay, if she, you know, all this and all that, don't be fooled if, let's say, she just says, oh, well, you know, uh, well, we'll see where it goes. Because I tell you, I've been through so much of these, even short, not too long, long distance relationships, and it always falls through the cracks. For some reason, I guess I'm too good of a person that I don't even know. Leave a comment down below if you think like this. But is it the saying true on TikTok what they say about good guys finished last or something like that? Because that, for me, that doesn't... I mean, I don't want to agree with that 
right i don't want i i think that's a different approach to somebody that's thinking in a negative and giving up on things i mean have i given up on things i mean i'm still kind of healing so i i wouldn't say i'm giving up but it's just i guess in one way or another on don's timing but i just don't understand the whole coming natural thing but i i just don't know i i don't know why she would say oh i'll just let it come naturally and then it's just you know not happening um but anyways yeah i just want to put that off my chest because maybe it's something that you think oh yeah I don't I don't understand that either but you know what that's just the other thing that I just don't understand about it coming naturally because you know uh I know that every girl has their things and been through abuse and everything and all, all sorts of relationships but I've never been in a true relationship that I would want like I I me personally I never abuse people like that because you know what I'm just a good person and uh, I think that you know everybody should be treated you know with some sort of respect I think and um, you know if my mom always told me treat others the way you want to be treated and if you treat others in an abusive way then it's just not a good fit and that's why most girls that I've been with so far have been broken damaged and sexually uh you know teasing and stuff like that and it's just it's not very healthy and that's what making it toxic and it kind of messes with my head a little bit and I don't like it so um yeah but you know what that's just all I have to say about that say what you will but um I don't know this is just something that I had to also get off my chest so what am I trying to say here is that I don't know. I'm recovering, but there's just some things that I probably left out from the last video. And uh, I'm just thank you for all your support and what have you. But uh, yeah, that's just all I have to say. So I uh, thank you so much for watching this video. It's not as long as the other video, but I just wanted to keep you all up in a loop of what is going through my mind so I can get it off my chest. Um, this is, you know, not really a venting video as much as the last one was kind of but um yeah anyways i just hope that you all have a great wonderful day and um stay strong and uh, just remember that love yourself because that's because that's important learn to love yourself and treat others the way you want to be treated and uh you know just etc but anyways this has been your boy jaguar Rays, and i'll see all you wonderful beautiful and amazing people in the next one till then cheers and uh bye bye for now